Today in this video, I will show you how to download offline dictionaries on your Android for free. And we'll tell you about best 6 offline dictionary apps that you can use without connected to the internet. A dictionary is a must-have app for smartphone users. No matter you are a student, teacher, researcher, or a parent. It will help to understand the meaning of new words, or will help to learn a new language. As it always not possible to stay connected to the internet, so you need to use a dictionary app that works offline. So in this video, we are going to share some best offline dictionary apps for Android smartphone and tablet users. The first app is English Dictionary Offline. The free offline English dictionary application explains the meaning of English words. Definitions are based on English Wiktionary. Fast search, easy and functional user interface, optimized also for tablets. It works offline without any further file to download. This dictionary contains no ads. Let's download this dictionary. Open Play Store. On the search bar type, English Dictionary Offline. This is the dictionary. You can see the screenshots. In these screenshots, they are showing the interface and features of the dictionary. Click on install. Wait while it's installing. Now the dictionary is being downloaded. Before opening it, first I will turn off the Wi-Fi so that we can see that it really works offline or not. I have turned off my Wi-Fi. Open the dictionary. This is the home page. It is having options like the world of the day, history, bookmarks, help, and random words. I will type a word in the search bar. By clicking on the play button you can listen to the pronunciation. They are showing adjectives, sentences, synonym, antonyms, related terms, translations, and nouns. Let's search for more words. You can see the details of the word. This is the history interface. This is the bookmark interface. So you can see this dictionary is working perfectly without the internet plus no ads are running. You can also download and use this dictionary. The second app is Dictbox Universal Offline Dictionary. In this dictionary, no internet required, fast and easy to use, pronunciation for any text, ability to find similar phrases or sentences, ability to install more dictionaries, more languages, and much more features. Let's download this dictionary. Open Play Store. On the search bar type, Dictbox Universal Offline Dictionary. This is the dictionary. You can see the screenshots. In these screenshots, they are showing the interface and features of the dictionary. Click on Install. Wait while it's installing. Now the dictionary is being downloaded. Before opening it, first I will turn off the Wi-Fi so that we can see that it really works offline or not. I have turned off my Wi-Fi. Open the dictionary. This is the home page. It is having options like your words, pop-up window, common word lists, word reminder, camera translator, and conversation. I will type a word in the search bar. By clicking on the play button you can listen to the pronunciation. They are showing adjectives, here they are showing definition, and here synonym. Go to the home page. Click on the common word list. Here you can see a word list like 1000 IELTS words with pronunciation. 
It is having 450 TOEFL words. You can review any of the words. Let's go to the home page. Click on the conversation. Here you can have a voice conversation. By clicking on your words button, you can access history. That's all about this app. The third app is Arcus Dictionary. Arcus Dictionary is a fast offline English dictionary with 165000 plus words, definitions, and synonyms. A 6.2 megabytes download gives you access to everything without requiring network access after install. Let's download this dictionary. Open Play Store. On the search bar type, Arcus Dictionary Offline. This is the dictionary. You can see the screenshots. In these screenshots, they are showing the interface and features of the dictionary. Click on Install. Wait while it's installing. Now the dictionary is being downloaded. Before opening it, first I will turn off the Wi-Fi so that we can see that it really works offline or not. I have turned off my Wi-Fi. Open the dictionary. This is the home page. I will type a word in the search bar. By clicking on the play button you can listen to the pronunciation. You can see the full detail of the word is mentioned. They are showing the word as a verb, adjectives, and noun. Let's search for more words. I have typed computer. They are showing the meaning of computer address, computer memory, computer storage, computer accessory, computer architecture, computer backup, and much more. That's all about this app. The fourth app is Dictionary Word Web. The free offline English dictionary and thesaurus include synonyms, related words, and great search. Let's download this dictionary. Open Play Store. On the search bar type, Dictionary World Web. This is the dictionary. You can see the screenshots. In these screenshots, they are showing the interface and features of the dictionary. Click on Install. Wait while it's installing. Now the dictionary is being downloaded. Before opening it, first I will turn off the Wi-Fi so that we can see that it really works offline or not. I have turned off my Wi-Fi. Open the dictionary. There is some database installation. Click on OK. This is the home page. I will type a word in the search bar. You can see the detail of the word. They are showing the word as a noun. The verb and adjective of the word are also mentioned down. Let's search for more words. You can see the detail of the word as a verb. Below they have shown noun, verb, adjective, and adverb of the word. That's all about this app. The fifth app is Offline Thesaurus Dictionary. Free Offline Dictionary and Thesaurus is a three-in-one free containing over 150,000 words and their synonyms and antonyms in three languages i.e. English, Spanish, and French Thesaurus. This dictionary contains no ads. Let's download this dictionary. Open Play Store. On the search bar type, Offline Thesaurus Dictionary. This is the dictionary. You can see the screenshots. In these screenshots, they are showing the interface and features of the dictionary. Click on Install. Wait while it's installing. Now the dictionary is being downloaded. Before opening it, first I will turn off the Wi-Fi so that we can see that it really works offline or not. I have turned off my Wi-Fi. Open the dictionary. This is the home page. You can see a lot of words. I will type a word in the search bar. You can see the detail of the word. They are showing the meaning, adjective, synonym, and antonym of the word. 
You can also see any word in the French language and Spanish language. Let's search for more words. You can see nouns, synonym, and antonyms. That's all about this app. There are no ads in this app plus it is working offline. The sixth app is Pocket Thesaurus. Vocabulary building is an essential part of acquiring a new language. Pocket Thesaurus helps you in that by providing everything you need to improve your language skills by enriching your vocabulary. Let's download this dictionary. Open Play Store. On the search bar type, Pocket Thesaurus. This is the dictionary. You can see the screenshots. In these screenshots, they are showing the interface and features of the dictionary. Click on Install. Wait while it's installing. Now the dictionary is being downloaded. Before opening it, first I will turn off the Wi-Fi so that we can see that it really works offline or not. I have turned off my Wi-Fi. Open the dictionary. This is the home page. You can see options like search, bookmarks, history, floating thesaurus, and advanced slash crossword search. I will type a word in the search bar. You can see the detail of the word. They are showing meaning, synonyms, and antonyms of the word. Let's search for more words. You can see meaning, synonym, and antonym. That's all about this app. There are no ads in this app plus it is working offline. It is easy to use and free. I'm done with showing you the best 6 offline dictionary apps that you can use without connecting to the internet. I hope this 